What is up everyone, this is Subtis A402 here, I'd like to present you guys a brand new Let's Play, and I'd like to say, Happy New Year to you all, hope you all, hope you all have, a, have a great Happy New Year's, as today is uh, January 1st, 2015, so goodbye 2014, hello 2015. Now, some of you guys may be wondering, what, what am I downloading? Well, I'm, I'm downloading uh, Catherine, but we're not going to do a Let's Play that, but... To people who see my previous videos, especially my Kingdom Hearts uh, 1 Final Mix Let's Play, well, the day has finally come. As I start, if I, yeah, there we go. Let's play Kingdom Hearts 2. I mean, Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 Remix. Well, I am up here on Kingdom Hearts 2, but but trying to be more specific. Gotta love that dear beloved. But enough talk. Let's just jump into the action. Oh yeah, I just got done watching the ball drop. It was amazing. I right, wish my friends and family happy uh <laughs> happy new year. <laughs> so he's so he's saying happy birthday. So yeah, man, so that's this is the this is the I'm, this is the game I'm I'm less playing on New Year's Day. That's a New Year's special. And let us all kick it off with a great new year. And again, once again folks, I hope you all have a great happy new year. Let's see how this year is going to turn out. Yeah, if you, if you guys remember on part 1 of Kingdom Hearts 1 Final Mix, I never did show the introduction of 1.5. But I want to give a, uh, Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 a chance. Alright, so welcome to the, to the, to the real main menu itself. And as you can see, because it's high on Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix, because that was the last time I ever played this, uh, played 2.5. So anyway, kind of like the uh, first um, first Kingdom Hearts 1.5, it has three Kingdom Hearts games, but this time it has uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix, which I will be opening in a few minutes, and there's a uh, Kingdom Hearts um, Birth by Sleep Final Mix, which was originally on the PSP, but they gave us a Final Mix version that was released in the um, in, in Japan along with Kingdom Hearts 2 and Kingdom Hearts 1. And just like the one on 1.5, this is this is the cutscene, also called Kingdom Hearts uh, Recoded. Well, as he had to spree, as had to spree through the cutscene so I can get all the trophies and all. But without further ado, enough with the introduction. It's time to start Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix HD. All right, let's get this show on the road, man. I've been. I've been waiting to do this let's play for a very long time. And I'm glad this day has finally came. So yep, so like I said, the Final Mix version was released in Japan a long time ago and, and, and which is now getting it. Yep, and I had this game since December 2nd, the day it came out. And I said to myself, I let's play it in on New Year's Day. As New Year's as a, as a New Year's special. Alright, I'm gonna show the uh the title screen. I'm trying not to hit the X button I mean, since I'm used to doing it every time I reboot this game. Alright. What you got what you guys should remember Sora and Hmm, who is that guy next to him? We'll get to him in a second. So, once again folks, I'd like to welcome you guys to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix HD for the PS3. Now, if you're playing this game for the very first time, this option is theater will not be available. The only way to unlock theater, you have to, you have to beat the game on any difficult setting. And so, we're going to start a new game. And yep, and unlike the standard version, uh, critical mode wasn't there. So, in this version, it has critical mode, a, a true test of skill for, the, for adept. Begin with certain abilities and other perks, and yeah, I can tell this difficult saying is hard as fuck, but there's a trophy for being on critical mode. There's pro mode, standard mode, and beginner's mode. But yeah, you know what? I'm aware that beginner's mode doesn't have the alternate ending, but... If I want to show off the alternate ending, I'll, I'll probably show off on the bonus video, which I should show off the alternate ending on the, uh, on uh, Kingdom Hearts 1 Final Mix. We'll, we'll think about that. But as usual, folks, we're gonna we're gonna start beginner's mode to do the much shitty as luck. I want the vibrations turned off. All right, game mode, beginner's mode, and vibrations off. Now, even though I even though I'm going for 100, 
I will not unlock the 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 uh, the, uh, the secret ending. All right, so it's time to get the show on the road. And yes, I already got my control of my hand, cause in a few seconds I'm gonna mute my television because of a certain song that's gonna play in a few minutes. And I do want, I do not want to get this video blocked or get taken down because of because of copyrighted shit. Disney Interactive Studios by Square Enix. Kingdom Hearts 2. Just like how the first game started. Yeah, folks, I know I didn't LP a uh, chain of memories, but memory we'll get to that in a second. Dream. I want to line the pieces up. Yours and mine. All right. Had to mute it. So you're not going to hear anything in the background. You're just going to hear me talking. So anyway, the name of this song that's playing right now is My Sanctuary by, uh, oh, I cannot pronounce her name. Sorry about that, folks. But I know who's singing, but it starts with an H. But this song really does kick ass, but too bad you guys won't be able to hear it. But, blame the copyright shit. Alright, so this cutscene starts out, well, it's showing the, uh, it's, it's kind of giving, giving us the recap on what happened in the, uh, in the previous Kingdom Hearts game. Mostly, uh, Kingdom Hearts 1 and, um, Chain of Memories. Alright, as you can see, we, yep, Sora found Kairi when she, uh, lost her heart. And this is when Sora finds out that he has Kairi's heart. And that's where the Ansem Riku comes in. Where he says, it is I, Ansem, the Seeker of Darkness. And yes, and how many times did Ansem say the word darkness? God only knows. And hello there, Ansem. And that's how Ansem died in the first game. And Sora sacrificed himself to save Kairi and the other Disney princesses. <laughs> oh my god, princesses. Oh my goodness. A little tongue tied today. So yeah. What else I can say about this game? I gotta say, this game is really, really amazing, man. This is the best Kingdom Hearts game ever, man. But I cannot wait to see how Kingdom Hearts 3 is gonna turn out. But we gotta wait till... Till... Till three, till three more years. I believe, well, some people say it's supposed to come out this year, but I believe, yeah, I believe it's going to come out in 2019. And look, it's Kyrie, she's grown up now, and, and hotter, too. And that girl you saw just now, we will get her, we'll, we'll see more about, you know what, since it was already mentioned in the chain of memories, I might as well give her, I might as well tell her who her name is. Her name is Naminé, and if you don't know who Naminé is, she was debuted in uh, Chain of Memories. She was the one that, um, she was the one that, that owned the, uh, well, she didn't build Castle Bolivia, but she, she owns, uh, Castle Bolivia, if I'm not mistaken, because I, I actually, I actually know who actually built, um, uh, uh, Castle Bolivia, and it's that certain character from, uh, Bird by Sleep. And so, what Timmer was about was that Sora, after, after the defense of Kingdom Hearts 1, it picks up where Kingdom Hearts 1 left off. Sora sees his castle, well, after he saw a black hooded man. So anyway, he sees the castle, he goes into the castle, and most of the worlds that he visited were illusions. And each time that Sora, Donald, and Goofy would make progress in the, um... In Castle Bolivian, they start to lose their memory each time they each time they go floor to floor. And so Sora and Donald and Goofy they had to uh, go to the top of the castle, fight off some of the um, those black hoodie features who goes by the name of the Organization Thirteen, like uh, like seen in Merlox. And so after. So after um after Sora fight the final boss, he meets Nominate again and uh he was sealed in that in that in that uh in that egg you saw a while ago. And and as a result, Sora is in a coma for two years just just to regain his memory back. 
He has a no my recap of Chamber Sound shittiest since I didn't do a let's play of it, but I know it's because I watched the uh, Hyper Kirby's uh, playthrough of it. And time to unmute the television. Alright, music's over. You have arrived. I've been to see him. But yeah, if you want to know more about Chain of Memories, y'all can look up Hyper Kirby's playthrough of it. I don't know uh, Riku's story too well. I, 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 need, I need to watch this cutscene so I can give you guys a few details. And no, guys, it's not a bug. It was programmed like that. You may notice that um that the other guy is talking. You don't hear him. You don't hear him say anything. Trust me, they didn't mess up the audio was programmed like that. Only for specific reasons. And yeah, we see flashbacks from the um from the first game. Whoa! <laughs> Give me a break, guy. See that giving up all right. Spoiler, this is just this is just Sora getting his uh memory there back. Are many other worlds out there. Why did we end up on this one? This world has been connected. Oh, he isn't voiced by Billy, uh, Billy Sane this time. Tied to the darkness. That's one. Sora, don't ever change. Well, at least he said darkness one time. The door has opened. What? You understand nothing. Come on. Not trying to criticize you or anything, but but uh, Billy Singh can act better than you, pal. Just saying. So all right. So now the cussing is over, and now we about to meet our new character in a few seconds. Yeah, I know some to the people who, who play Kingdom Hearts for, for the very first time. I bet and didn't play Chain of Memories. Dream about him. I bet y'all got I bet up to this point y'all be y'all be wondering what happened to Sora. Well, I already give out the I already give a, a little small recap of uh, Chain of Memories. But here, folks, meet our new character, Roxas. Where did Roxas came from? We will we will learn much later. Now I'm gonna tell you right now, this game does start to a little dull in the in the Roxas chapter, but trust me, it will it will get better. It's gonna get a little interesting as we make progress in this in this let's play. Cause I, I'm not gonna lie, when I first played this, I'm like, well, I was starting not to like it at first, but then I somehow got into it. Yes, it does. It kind of starts out dull, but it isn't too bad, though. No, don't get me wrong. It doesn't start out shitting like that. It's just slow and everything, slow and all. Did that take you off? Yeah, that's just wrong. But yeah, I hope you guys see my point of view. I mean. It's true that stuff's been stolen around town, and we've got a score to settle with Cypher and everything. So, if he wants to think we did it, I can't really blame him. See, that's not what really bugs me. Apparently someone's going around stealing shit. What really bugs me is that he's going around telling everybody we're the thieves. Now the whole town and their mothers are treating us like the Klepto Club. See so here, folks, this is the first video of 2015. Right? I haven't. Nuh-uh. Never. I wouldn't be surprised if I accidentally said 2014, because it can happen. <laughs> it can freaking happen. I just gotta, get, I just gotta get used to saying 2015. You know what I mean? And yeah, Ross 51. On the other hand, he's also starting his new Let's Play of 2015. Matter of fact, he's playing right now. And nope, I'm not gonna show you what he's playing. We can find the real thieves. That now I'll just spoil it for him, for his viewers. You know? What about Cipher? First, we gotta clear our names. 
Once we find the real culprit, everyone will get off our backs. Uh, oh no! They're gone! Our... are gone! Did you just curse? Our shit is gone? <laughs> My thoughts are saying when I first played this. All are... gone? You can't say why not. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just find it hilarious. You can't say our are gone. Stolen. And not just the the word. They stole it too. Oh my god. I'm sorry, this is just hilarious. This is like it, it's like watching this on A and E. The Soprano edition. <laughs> His heart is returning. Oh, Count Dooku! Hello, Count Dooku! A.K.A. Christopher Lee! Roxas, come on! Alright. Do, do, do. I actually love the Twilight Town music. Oh yeah, and just like the first Kingdom Hearts on the Found Mix version, the PS3 version, in this version of Kingdom Hearts 2 Found Mix HD, all the music has been remastered. And I gotta tell you one thing, they're awesome as fuck. Just wait till we just wait till we get to a couple of boss boss battles. All right, move the last to make Ross's run. Tell the slide to make Ross's Ross's walk. Jump with the circle button, push to the armor shop. If you can't remember what to do next, press the start button to confirm your objective. Alright. Can I actually, can I actually go back and save? Alright, let me see if I can go back and save. Nah, nah. Oh yeah, you can't save, but you can't save. But you, you save like shortly. So let's go to the armor shop. By skimming the sides of the building, you can grab edges and pull yourself up like you did in the first game. Try to for SS to various place. Let's get this investigation underway. And yeah, no talkie, but I don't mind though. Oh yeah, unlike the first game, when you press when you press pause during the dialogue, you can actually skip the dialogue cutscene, but we're not gonna do that since this is a let's play. Now now, th th there are some minor changes in the uh, in the HD version, like they did with the first game. Just like in the first game, they added extra cutscenes that was never shown in the uh, standard versions. And yes, I will point I will point it out when we get to that point. I just love, I just love how I'm not reading this. If I'm, if I'm going too fast, I'm sorry about this, folks. I just want to get some certain things out the way, you know. All right, now we gotta ask her about about what's been stolen. Art is gone. Where can we find the? One way to find out. Reaction commands are used to execute uh, actions according to the situations. Press tr uh, approach to the, to the accessory shop and press talk. The reaction command will appear. Press triangle. Uh, talk to the assassin sh sh shop owner. Yes, I'm not a fast reader. <laughs> Hello, Roxas. All right. Oh, it's you, Roxas. Please don't let me down. You used to be one of my favorite customers. I'm not a thief. Okay. It's no fun having everyone suspect me, you know. Then you've got to find a way to clear your name. The woman at the candy shop is pretty disappointed too. Well, we've been framed. We've been framed. What can we do, folks? Roxas, have you seen my cat around? Uh, oh, he's on the he's on the window shed. All right, now it's gonna tell us to hit R1 to all right. Move the camera with the right stick and press R3. Turn to default position. Press R1 to lock on specific things. When lock on something, the camera will automatically follow the target. Lock onto the cat like that. Locking on is useful when following a target. The camera can be controlled while locked on. Press R1 again to cancel. 
Like in the first game. Thank you, Roxas. Did they steal something from you too? Oh my, yes, yeah, something important. Just, just so let, just so you know, we didn't do it. I believe you. Thanks for, thanks for that, ma'am. So, what did they take from you? My, my precious. Looks like the corporate is going around stealing, and not just the, the word. They stole it too. <laughs> he just said that, dude. This isn't your average thief. I wonder if Cypher would know anything about this. We gotta talk to him. Come on to the sound a lot. Sand a lot, sorry. Keep thinking it says sand a lot like like Ocelot, you know what I mean? <laughs> Alright. Is it gonna let me save after this? Oh shoot. Oh yeah, we're not gonna save in a while, so yeah, so Yeah, I guess that this cutscene goes off, we're gonna end we gonna end, we're gonna end the episode because we're not gonna get to the save point in a, in, a, in, a, in a quite a while. You can give us back the now. Yeah, you're the only ones who would take it, you know? If you look closely, whenever the word got blurred out, you can you can clearly see he said the word word. What did you do? Burn it. <laughs> Not that we need some to prove that you're losers. Replay. Okay, man. He needs he needs to get a, he needs to get a new fucking shirt, man. He doesn't look he looks fucking fruity in that tank. I guess if you get on your knees and beg, maybe I'll let it slide. He really looks fruity in that tank. <laughs> Roxas. All right. I think I think it's a safe point here. Oh yeah, it's just like the first game we had to select our weapons. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, man, we, this is where we're going to end the first part, so... Hope you guys enjoy my new Let's Play of Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix HD. And be warned, folks. This may be a long Let's Play, but let's see how it turns out. So once again, folks, hope you guys have a happy, happy new year. Now, see you guys next time on part 2 of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix HD. So until next time, Celtics A42, out.